I'm doing a quick power hour with you guys, which is some of my top pieces that we have available in our London boutique. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed Sophie's show. She's also just done a power hour and now it's my turn. So this is actually a live show shopping experience. You can shop all of the products that I'm showcasing throughout the next hour. If you do see something that you like, there will be icons in the top left hand corner around here on your screen that you can click on and it will take you through to the website where you can see further images and details of all of the products that I'm showcasing. I'm also here to answer any of your questions about the products if you need and you guys can ask me those questions in that comment box Which is at the bottom of your screen now. I'm gonna go through around 20 pieces We've got some really amazing prices and also some gorgeous pieces that I think are perfect for autumn winter um, We take several payment methods. We take credit debit and Amex We take Apple pay PayPal and we also have a layaway option, which is called split it This is actually where you can split the total value of your order over the duration of up to 12 months all you need is a credit card with the total of your order available on the card to check out and then you don't actually have to wait to pay the item off you can literally check out we'll ship it to you and then you can pay it off over however many months you decided to choose on your payment plan with split it we've got Rachel moderating from behind the scenes hey Rach and we are covering customs and duties for the duration of the show now shipping is between 10 pounds and 35 pounds depending on where you're located uh, hey Rach oh thank you Sarah yeah, I did change the colour. I went slightly darker. Um, I'm going to get started. We've got 20 pieces to get through and I'm going to be here for one hour, guys. I'm going to start with a bag that I am absolutely loving for this season. So this is actually a very special and very rare Chanel lilac lambskin crossbody now as you can see this is in a classic flap style with the classic turn lock but the strap on this isn't a leather and twine chain this is actually a leather um, quilted strap that goes as a crossbody so it's kind of like a classic flap but has more kind of a daytime satchel style feel which i really love now if you guys are unaware i have seen purple in all of the new season um collections chanel are doing um lilacs and purples as their kind of autumn winter color this year and this is in fact vintage you can kind of get one of the original pale lilacs from chanel um with us today it's absolutely gorgeous um, in terms of the condition, condition is great. There is, I'd say some light discoloration just to the base, uh, but I'd still rate the condition a good kind of seven, eight out of 10. And as you can see, we've got this gorgeous 24 karat gold gilded hardware to the front, which shines like this beautiful br bright yellow color. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I think this combination with the lilac and the, um, the lilac and the gold is amazing. I don't actually think I've ever seen another Chanel vintage bag in this lilac color until we got this one in. So it's a super rare color um, and really hard to get as well. It also has a back pocket. It opens up into a single flap with a compartment to the front and then we've got a nice lambskin lined interior with additional compartments for you to keep your things organized. In terms of the year, this is actually a, let's have a look. This is a four series. So this is a 1994 to 1996 Chanel bag. Very iconic mid nineties. You can get the skew rate. I just popped it in the collection. Um, it is ASL 2481. How gorgeous is this Ruru? Hi everyone. Good morning, good afternoon. Where are you all tuning in from today? Um, okay, let me show you what this looks like on. So it comes with its original serial sticker still intact. It clearly reads four series, which is 1994. It's a slightly high cross, so it sits kind of just below the waist and above the hip, which is a great crossbody. Just as a size reference, I'm five foot 11, so I'm on the taller side. So if you are shorter than me, it will sit even lower, um, and it's absolutely beautiful. Honestly, I love this. We've got Maureen from Atlanta. Atlanta, what time is it in Atlanta, Maureen? Um, so Rachel's going to let us know the price of this in the comments. It is going to be pinned in that top left-hand corner. kel has got her first day of annual leave. Oh, enjoy, Kel. I hope you have a really nice time off and a nice break. Um, let me show you a close-up of this again. It's absolutely beautiful. Uh, Danica's saying she's seen this in real life. Oh, thanks, Maureen, for watching me so early. Uh, Ruru, there's no marks. I would say there's some very, very slight discoloration to the base. Um, just around kind of the edging here, but it's still really great condition. It's kind of minimal to be honest, but obviously we're always very transparent with the condition. There's no actual scuffing or rubbing to the leather itself. It's just slightly darker to the base where someone must have popped it 
down somewhere and it's just picked up a bit of colour transfer here. But apart from that, there's no colour transfer to the front. There's also no um, colour transfer to the back. So overall, it's in really, really good condition. And it's just stunning. It's also a really nice bag, just classically over the shoulder. The colour is so beautiful. It's a really, really light lilac. As you can see, colour of the season. And the strap on this is also in great condition. I love this, honestly. I think this is a really special bag. Um, it's gorgeous. Yeah, Susie, honestly, it's such a good, it's such a good piece. Um, so what we're gonna do, we'll get the price up in the comments and then you'll see an icon here. If you guys are new, then you can shop the products through the icons once they appear in that top left-hand corner. She's a beautiful bag, very, very collectible. Um, perfect combination, exactly. It really, really is. Um, mascara, I don't know, Fatima, what mascara I use. I'll have to take a picture of it, and um, if you DM me, I can send you a picture of it tonight. Um, I can't remember, I'm so sorry. Um, the price of this is £3,950, which is dollars. As mentioned, we cover customs and duties, so you're saving yourself um, really, really great um, savings on this, especially if you're shopping from outside of the UK, you can avoid those horrible customs fees. For under £4,000, for a very collectible and rare lilac lambskin, is a really really great price it's not something that you can find very easily as i've said i've been with luxury promise now for four and a half years this is the first lilac i've ever seen so it's definitely rare considering i see handbags all day long it is pinned in that top left hand corner take a look let me know if you guys have any questions um, and if not i'm going to move on to the next piece Okay, I'm going to move on to a really perfect bag for winter. Next up, we have a Fendi Mama bag, which is actually crafted from like a cashmere wool. So really, really lovely wintry piece. Um, as you can see, it's in grey. It's in a dark charcoal grey colour and has the Fendi Zuka logo all the way throughout the bag. And it's paired with silver hardware. A really nice day and evening bag, this. You can actually um, adjust the strap. So you can adjust it to longer or shorter if you wish. Or you can even completely change the strap and actually add... <laughs> oh, Kel, I'm so sorry that you're on a ban island and it's in your car. It's a really good one, though. Um, you can actually completely remove the strap. And if you wanted to, you can actually add a, a crossbody as well. Now, when it comes to the mama bag of Fendi, it's a great size. For me, this is a really, really great piece to have. Um, it's collectible. It's classic. It's very well known for the Fendi house. Um, and the grey wool is going to go with everything. I really love kind of knitted and woolen bags or suede, something that has a little bit more texture. Um, like I just think it adds really nice depth to an outfit. So I'm a huge fan of this bag. Asma went on auction the other day. It's such a shame the person who made the final bit. I know it's such a beautiful bag, the lilac. Um, the price is obviously great, so it will have been reduced as well, considering it was in an auction, so it will still be listed at the auction price. So if anybody does want to get hold of the uh, lilac, it is pinned in that top left-hand corner. It's such a great bag, honestly. Um, it's one of my favourites that we, we actually have in the whole London boutique, so we have a lot of bags here, guys, but it's a really special one. Now, back to this Fendi mo uh, Mama. So as you can see, we've got this really beautiful, um, like, box-like leather in good condition. I'd say very light scratching, minimal scratching actually. This is in very good condition. Wool and knit, knitted and kind of wicker bags are actually really, really durable because um, they don't scratch. There's no pulls, there's no you know signs of wear. Um, we have auctions, Ash, all the time actually, part of, um, part of our shows. Um, we literally have like, I don't know, surprise auctions happening all the time. So uh, just, you just have to tune into the live shows and hopefully you'll join one when we have an auction. This inside is lined with black leather. Excellent condition. I love a black lined, a leather lined bag inside because you can keep it really clean. So you can actually just buy leather wipes, you can wipe it down um, and it will keep it really nice and clean. Let me show you what this looks like on. I'm wearing quite a casual outfit today. I've gone for just black jeans and a black top and this bag would go perfectly as would it with anything else. It's a great size bag for medium essentials. You could fit a full size wallet in this. You could fit um, obviously your phone, your keys, some makeup if you wanted to as well. 
Um, and it's in excellent condition. I agree, Maureen, leather lined is so luxurious, but also really practical as well. If you're like me, I carry like some powder around, I carry like my lipsticks and stuff like that. Um, so I always worry that makeup will spill in my bag, but with black lined um, interior, leather, it's uh, not a problem, so yeah. Let's get the price up of the Fendi. As you can see, it's a, kind of like a soft slouchy look as well. I really like the way that it kind of slouches. It has that kind of hobo style. The price is amazing. This is 850 pounds, which is 940 US dollars. That's way under a thousand pounds for a very iconic Fendi mama bag in excellent condition. It's a classic. It's iconic for the brand. It's going to hold its value because it is a classic. Um, and it is pinned. You guys can see pictures. Um, further information and details through the icon, which is pinned in that top left-hand corner. We are covering customs and duties. Um, okay, and this won't fit a 13-inch MacBook. No, this is slightly smaller. This is more of kind of like a medium-sized essentials. Um, TH. Hey, I put quotes through on Thursday through the website. Any idea when you'll hear back? Yeah, so you, you'll always hear back for quotations within 48 working hours. So you'll hear back today from the team. Um, okay, that's pin, guys. Check it out. Let me know if there's any questions. Um, I'm going to show you guys some jewellery and then we'll move on to some other brands. But at any point, if you do want me to recap an item, just let me know in that comment box and we can do that. So when it comes to Chanel vintage earrings and jewellery especially, there's one particular item that is really like, if you're looking to build out a collection of vintage jewellery and you want some really iconic pieces, there's one particular pair of earrings called the Chanel Turnlocks that you just have to have in your collection. I have a pair, Winnie has a pair, Sabrina has a pair, and they are honestly one of my all-time favorite classic styles of earrings from Chanel. Now, they usually come out from kind of 1995, 1996. These are from 1995, which means that they are actually gilded in 24 karat gold. Anything before 2008 in Chanel was gilded in real 24 karat gold, hence this incredible, bright, shiny gold color that you see throughout a lot of the Chanel vintage. In Chanel now, the current season pieces are slightly dull, um, duller anyway. They don't have that really vibrant kind of yellowy look that the vintage pieces have. These are in great condition. Um, Janie got them with the Diamantes. Honestly, they're stunning, Janie. Um, these are the classics. These are, I think, the medium size. Uh, Ruru has them as well, very comfortable even with no pads. They are, they're surprisingly lightweight actually. Um, they have the Turnlock CC logo, clips at the back, and they'll sit kind of here on the ear for a nice, secure, comfortable wear. Um, if you do find clip-ons slightly uncomfortable, you can actually, um, you can actually buy um, kind of like gel pads that sit over the clip. Oh, the Fendi sold. Congrats guys, who got the Fendi? This is such a good bag, honestly. Congratulations to whoever got that. Great choice, a perfect wintry bag. This will be shipped out to you tomorrow. So as I was saying with the clip-ons, if you do find them slightly uncomfortable or you have um, sensitive ears, I like me, you can actually buy um, like sleeves, gel sleeves that sit on the back of the clip and make them really comfortable um, to wear. So just in case, um, you need to find those. You can find them on Amazon. This is what the earring will look like on. It will sit nice and snug to the lobe. Um, I think these are a nice daytime wear, but also perfect for the evening as well. And they really do just transform um, any outfit. Again, I'm wearing all black, quite classic. And then this, you just pop, pop a pair of Chanel earrings on and it really does transform your whole look. So we will get the price up of these. They're in excellent condition, just to confirm. Back is nice and clean, no tarnish, bright yellow gold. I'd say some hairline scratches, but still excellent condition. And oh, Rachel, I know you love the mama as well. Congratulations to whoever got that. Now the turn locks are £1,150, which is US dollars We are covering customs and duties and we ship worldwide. They are the medium size. Uh, sorry, they're the large size. Absolutely gorgeous. These are, let me double check. If you guys could see how small the hallmark is on the back, sometimes I can't actually read it. That might actually say 2096. Uh, yeah, okay, Cece, you're right. They are 1996, not 1995. They are pinned. You guys can find pictures, details. Let me know in that comment box. 
If you have any questions, they are absolutely beautiful and they are available for you guys to shop. I am going to move on to some Gucci nets. Um, a very, a really nice bag actually. This is a Gucci kind of soft slouch pochette style. It's crafted from canvas. Um, GG canvas, we've got orange leather to match, kind of like a burnt orange, um, and I really like this. I like how it's just a classic beige tone with the canvas, and then we've got kind of subtle elements of colour here with the orange. This is going to go with everything. Um, Ash in-store 10% off was only for the weekend, that was only a two-day event, that's no longer happening now, uh, but we've got lots more in store for you guys over the next couple of months in-store. Um, most Saturdays we'll be doing events, so definitely if you can come down on a Saturday, um, do it, because yeah, lots of exciting things happening in store. Now this is in excellent condition. We have, I'd say some very light, actually no corner wear to be honest. There's no scuffing or um, discoloration to the canvas. Inside is lined with chocolate brown nylon. Again, nylon's a really, uh, another really great um, interior material, because it's slightly waterproof as well. Um, Hey Penny, any chance LP could price much on the earrings? Yen sold same pair with box yesterday. I I will have to look into that, Penny, because I've personally never seen a pair of turnoffs go for £850. Um, they usually go for like 1100 plus, so our price is pretty competitive. I will have to look into that. Um, maybe I'll ask one of the girls to. Uh, but yeah, I, I, I can't price much on a show because I can't obviously look at the back end to see what we can do. But Rach, maybe if you could have a quick look to see what we could do. Um, but I will have to just double check that order because they may be a different style. They may have been smaller than the ones that we've got because these are the large. So there's a lot of thing, variations that will um, you know, make a difference with the price. Um, but I can look into that after. Um, so with this, the handle is kind of structured actually, which I really like. As you can see, it's upright, it's rounded and sits really comfortably under the arm. I love this bag. I love the hardware to the front. We've got small gold hardware pieces and then that really lovely ring here at the base as well. This is a great day to night bag. It's in excellent condition and I am so ready to see the price of this. I think it's going to be a really, really great price. Um, great condition back. No corner, guys, the price is insane. We can definitely fit a phone inside this bag. I actually have the, the 12 Max in front of me, guys, and it would fit two of them in. So it's perfect for a phone. It's perfect for medium essentials. This will fit a full length wallet as well. It's great for those kind of things. Um, it's really nice and um, spacious. And we've even got the Gucci logo on the side here in gold. Um, Oh, Chrissy, let me, let me after the show, let me chase, um, let me look into that because it was definitely shipped the day after I left. So I will look into that. The Gucci bag is £425, under £500 for a really classic style Gucci. That is $469 US dollars. Customs and duties are covered and we ship worldwide. It is pinned up here, guys. Take a look. Let me know if I can help you with anything regarding this piece. A great price though. Um, that's even less than like a Louis Vuitton, um, like a Louis Vuitton um, pochette, even less than that. And it's classic vintage Gucci. So I really, really love this. Hi everyone on Instagram saying hello. Um, that is pinned. Let me know guys. So when it comes to winter, I always like to kind of try my best to brighten up my wardrobe and not wear all black, which is funny because I'm wearing all black today. But when it comes to accessories, winter whites for me are really elegant and classic and they just kind of brighten my mood when the, when the weather's cold and dull outside. This is a perfect winter white. This is a, a, a Balenciaga clutch bag. It's crafted from a really durable, durable leather. Now, if you guys are unaware of the leather that Balenciaga use, it is designed to age really well and kind of distress naturally um, for a really long wearing, hard wearing bag. This literally will last you a lifetime. It's in a snow white and it also has gold hardware. Um, Balenciaga has, I say could made a comeback, I've always loved Balenciaga, but the city kind of uh, motocross style with the tassels is the absolute 
rage at the moment. Everybody's loving it, including even the boots. Even the boots have the tassels in this particular hardware. This is a very iconic style for Balenciaga and very much on trend currently. This can be used in so many ways. You could use this as an iPad case. This would fit a small laptop inside. It has an additional front pocket here, which is perfect for credit cards and business cards and a small phone you could fit here. And then the zip actually goes all the way around the edge of the bag and then opens up for a nice um, clean interior. Black, lin um, black cotton lined interior in excellent condition. Um, as you can see, we've got like a leather fold out here so the bag does expand for a nice spacious compartment. And for me, this would be my kind of everyday clutch bag. I would use this when I'm traveling. It's a great document holder. It's a really amazing multifunctional piece um, and a classic white you just cannot go wrong with. There's no discoloration, no color transfer. There's no staining. It's literally nine out of 10 condition, no corner wear, no scuffing. Um, and guys, a really on-trend piece. This price is gonna be way, way less than the store. Balenciaga bags tend to go for, you know, over a thousand pounds now. Um, and this is practically, you know, in an excellent condition. And we have it for under 500 pounds. It's 495 pounds, which is 547 US dollars. We cover your customs, we cover your duties. It is pinned in that top left-hand corner. It's a great classic clutch. Um, a great way to brighten up an outfit. My winter wardrobe is so, so dark, like everything's dark neutral. So I love adding, you know, a hint of white um, to any look. And this would also make a great day clutch, but would also make a great evening clutch as well for a special occasion. So it's a really great multifunctional all round piece on trend. The price is amazing. Um, and it is pinned in that top left hand corner. Um, let me know guys, if you want to see anything in particular, if you want me to recap any of the pieces I've been through so far, we're 20 minutes in, I'm going to be live for the next hour. Um, and I'm going to move on to another piece now. So another really trendy piece that we have in today is actually the Hermes Gigi Clutch. The Gigi Clutch is a very classic style of clutch from the house of Hermes. It is, um, it's quite a hard bag to find actually in store. Um, and I'm a huge fan of it. It's so elegant and chic. Now this particular one, I picked this because it's in denim. Denim has been so on trend currently. It is all over all of the runways in Paris Fashion Week. Denim really is kind of the it thing to be wearing right now. And that's why I picked this bag today. It's crafted from a mid-wash denim and it's beautifully paired with this incredible kind of light brown leather with contrast stitching. It's like a gold leather with the contrast stitch. The good thing about denim is it's really durable and hard wearing material. So denim, you know, you can't scratch denim. Um, you can't really like pull it. It's, it's really durable and hard wearing. You know when you find a pair of jeans that fit you so, so well and you end up wearing them for like 15 years? It's the same thing when it comes to denim bags. They just last a lifetime. This is in excellent condition. We've got no, um, we've got maybe some slight corner wear, very, very minimal scuffing. Um, but there's no, you know, discoloration to the back. There's no scratching to the leather. And there's no significant signs of wear on this. It's a very good condition piece. The Gigi clutch actually opens up with this leather compartment and inside is in pristine condition. No staining, no discoloration. And again, the Gigi clutch can be worn for daytime, it can be worn for evenings. It's a really multifunctional use bag. Great for summer, great for winter. And you can even add underneath the flap here, you could add a colored twilly if you wanted to, to add some color. You could add a gold chain or a silver chain and style it as a small kind of shoulder bag. Uh, get creative with it, make your own ways and styles with these pieces, I love to do that. Um, and you can get your hands on a very collectible Gigi clutch from Hermes, something that we do not come across very often at all. The denim color is perfect to me. I think it's a really nice kind of all season blue um, and actually matches the new season shearling and suede um, ship pro sandals that they've recently launched in store. So um, a color that they are doing more regularly now in their more current season pieces. Um, it will come with a luxury promise box and dust bag. It's in an excellent condition. We will get the price up in the comments and then we'll move on to the next piece. If you guys are just tuning in, first of all, welcome. Um, if you guys do want to see what I've been through so far, click on the handbag icon at the bottom part of your screen to see a full list of everything. The Gigi clutch is available for £2,200. 
which is 2,432 US dollars, covered customs and duties, and we ship worldwide. You can shop with us wherever you are in the world, and it is pinned in that top left-hand corner. Okay, I'm gonna move on, guys. Ooh, where shall I go next? Okay. And the Balenciaga has sold. Congratulations. Great choice. Honestly, this is such a great bag. Um, congrats to whoever got that. Just so you know, all of these items will be shipped tomorrow. And if you're in the UK, you'll receive them by Wednesday. If you're outside of the UK, you'll receive them literally this week. It's really quick, um, really quick shipping service. Now there's one bag that I've included today. Yeah, I got it. Thank you. <laughs> um, Oh, Kimberly got it. Congrats. Honestly, I like I'm an absolute sucker for wearing it. I think it's so important to lighten up your your looks and with a white bag, you can do that honestly so easily. So congratulations and I hope my tips helped. Um okay, I'm moving on to another bag that I'm totally obsessed with for so many reasons. This is actually more of a casual style Chanel bag. And as you can see, it is crafted from tweed. Now, if you are regulars on our show, you know how much we love tweed at Luxury Promise, how collectible tweed is, um, and how much of a great investment piece um, Chanel tweed is in itself. This is a bag that I've never seen before. Um, I love how unique it is and how um, the fit kind of reminds me of the medium Evelyn size. So if you do like the look of an Evelyn, but you wanted something maybe slightly different, this is a great alternative. Um, this is grey and cream tweed. We've also got the camellia flower here, which is made of layered layers of tweed in a, like a floral logo. Um, the camellia flower is very iconic for the house of Chanel. Coco Chanel, actually, it was her favourite flower, the camellia flower. So you'll see this throughout a lot of her designs, um, even new season and vintage as well. Um, this is a single flap opening. There's so many details of this bag that I just love, including the chain that you see to the underneath of the flap. Now this is actually, um, you usually see this on Chanel ready to wear jackets, especially the vintage ones. They actually line the base of jackets um, with the chain to hold them down. It's kind of acts like a weight so that they don't kind of curl up. And they've done the same with this bag. So the chain is there to actually hold down the flap so it has a nice seamless look when the bag is closed. So I really like that. You can also see we've got a smaller compartment to the front, which has silver zips. Inside here is great for small essentials. Um, you could fit, you know, a small wallet in here. You could fit your phone in here. And then the bag has one main compartment at the back, which is lined with nylon um, for all of your slightly bigger items. This would definitely fit like a, an iPad or a small MacBook inside, which is for me a really, really great thing. Um, my laptop goes everywhere with me. So if you're anything like me, having a bag that fits something like that inside, I will get the measurements just to double check. Um, but this would be a great kind of satchel style bag for an everyday wear. We've got another compartment in the front. And then we get to the good part, guys. The, the, the strap on this bag is something I've never seen on any other bag. So this has, not only does this have leather entwined chaining, which we see classically throughout a lot of Chanel's, they've actually doubled that. So we've got two leather entwined chains, plus we've got this kind of plaited knot details around the chain surrounding it that is then knotted into the bag like this. And the reason why I love this so much is it's a long cross, firstly, it's a long cross, so it has that kind of casual, daytime, soft, cross the body satchel, but actually it almost has this jewellery. This is like jewellery that's a handbag strap. This is like um, really, really beautiful. The way that it sits as a crossbody, I just think, again, crosses and gives you this really amazing look um, rather than just having a leather plain strap or even just a single chain. This can dress up any outfit. Again, I'm wearing all black. I've gone really simple today. And then you just pop this bag on as a crossbody and it completely transforms the look and gives a really, really unique feel. It's so comfortable, Kel, I agree. Um, it makes it more comfortable to wear, it really does. And that's because the leather is kind of wrapped around the chain. So the chain doesn't actually sit on the shoulder or across the body. You've almost got the padding from the leather. So it not only looks great, but it's a really, really comfortable look. Um, this is more of an understated, classic Chanel and um, there's no logos it is just you know it's an if you know you know the way that it sits as a cross is epic honestly I love it um, 
yeah, I absolutely love it. Really unique, if you know, you know piece. A classic tweed. Let me get the measurements for you. I think we've got a measuring. Let me just grab a measure up. Okay, let me measure this for you guys. So the total width is 11 inches and then the total length is 13. So if my measuring is correct, you can actually fit a 13 inch MacBook inside this. Um, honestly, I love it. I love this bag, if you can't tell. <laughs> I think it's really fun. Again, a bag that I have not seen before. This is the only one I've seen like this. This is a really fun, trendy, casual daytime bag. And the tweed is in the most perfect gray cream with silver kind of entwining details through. It's in excellent condition and the price is just amazing. This is a tweed Chanel, guys. It's so collectible, and yet we have it with us here today for £1,663, which is US dollars The price is honestly amazing. You can barely even buy small leather goods at that price now in Chanel, let alone this amazing strap and tweed crossbody. Um, it is pinned. It's pinned in that top left-hand corner. Um, is that the handle is actually leather with chains. So as you can see, We've got this leather entwined chain doubled up and then we've got this kind of plat knot detailing which goes all the way around. The whole strap is like this. We've got kind of a knot detail here and then this loops in through compartments to the top. There we go. Um, and if you guys have any questions about this, let me know. I'll show you the back quickly before we move on. Isn't it gorgeous? I know, honestly, this is, like, as I said, it really reminds me of the Evelyn, the medium Evelyn size, because it's kind of the same length strap. It sits around hip length. Um, it's, it's a nice casual daytime. The bag is lightweight and flexible, so it's comfortable to wear. It's beautiful, honestly, I love it. I think it's stunning. The fact that you have this insane chain detail on such an elegant bag, gives a really unique and fun look. So I absolutely love it, guys. I hope you do as well. Um, and it is pinned. Gorgeous. So Alison on Instagram, we do actually have somebody saying sold on Instagram. You will have to log on to my Luxury Promise live show. I'm live at luxurypromise.com. This isn't a sold show, so you will have to head over to our website. This is now live on our new arrivals. So if you head to our new arrivals on our website, you can just check out on this one and it's all yours. Let me give you the um, year as well. It's a 10 series, which I think is, let me work this out. It's kind of like mid 2000s. I have a feeling that's around 2006 and seven, roughly. But yeah, it's a 10 series. So it's kind of a vintage piece as well, which makes it even more fun. Um, I love this strap. <laughs> I'm literally obsessed. Like if I could just wear the strap on its own as well, I absolutely would. I think it's amazing. Um, so that is available, guys. Let's do um, some small pieces from Hermes next. Next up, I have a unworn, unused neoprene pouch from the House of Hermes. This is in the beautiful, beautiful, bright box orange color. It matches the box um, and is obviously the most classic color from the House of Hermes. Now, I love this. I think this is great. It has black, a black hardware for a really cool, trendy look. And then we've got a leather pull at the end of the zip there. As I said, this is unworn, so there's no signs of wear, no discoloration. The inside is black. They really thought the design of this through. The inside is black, so if you're using this as a makeup pouch, um, the inside is black, so you're not obviously gonna stain any parts of the orange. When it comes to these small pouches, they are great for so many reasons. Um, I use mine personally if I'm traveling and I'm carrying a big bag. Um, I will use it to keep my passport in, keep my lipsticks in, all my small things, set of keys, you know, all those things you need to grab often and easily, I keep inside a small pouch inside a bigger bag. You could also use this as a clutch bag. I think it's a really cool clutch. Again, easy, nice color, nice pop of color for your wardrobe. Um, Alison, I will show you that bag on again in just a second. Um, 
And yeah, excellent condition. A great kind of easy, no-brainer piece, something that you can just use forever in so many ways. Um, let me show you the back as well. So we've got a nice plain back and then we've got that Hermes logo to the front here. This would make a great gift as well as it is unworn. I know it's quite early, but I think some of us are already planning for Christmas. These could make great Christmas presents or presents to yourself. A great organizer, a great clutch, and again, another easy piece that you can use for a lifetime. So we'll get the price up of this one. And then Alison, I will show you the uh, Chanel on a, uh, as a cross in just a second. Let me know if you did tune into the live on the website. Um, yeah, Rachel's ready for Christmas. Okay, this is 300 pounds. 300 pounds, which is 330 US dollars for a neoprene um, classic pouch from Hermes. It's slightly padded, so it's great for if you're keeping your phone and those kind of things inside. It's pinned, it's got its original tag still on. It's a great price, great organizer, great clutch bag, and the color is amazing. So again, another great piece, guys. It's pinned in that top left-hand corner. And I'm gonna quickly show Alison on Instagram this as a crossbody. Let me tilt that camera down slightly. So this is what the chain looks like here. And then the bag sits kind of hip, hip height. There we go. Alison, I hope that helps. Let me know if you've got any other questions. Okay, let's go. Oh, it's sold. It's sold. Congrats. Someone just bought my favorite bag of the day. Congratulations, you have amazing taste. This is like such a cool bag. And um, congrats to whoever got that. A really, really great choice. It's such a good piece. Okay, let's do another orange box before we move on to some other, um, other bags. So um, another great giftable piece. Something for the guys as well. This is a unisex piece, a really nice home decor piece. Um, I've actually bought lots of my friends this for birthdays and Christmas because it makes a really, really thoughtful and fun gift that everybody can kind of um, use in the household. So this is actually a pair of playing cards. Yes, Hermes does playing cards. I think it's so cool that they do stuff like this. Um, and they are absolutely stunning. Honestly, these on a dining room table or on a coffee table in your living room will just absolutely transform. It's gonna look amazing. Um, so these are giant playing cards. So they're kind of, I think, triple the size of what a standard playing card um, is usually sized at. And they are beautifully designed. So they've got this gorgeous kind of neutral um, Hermes logo to the front. They are silver lined. So they have this really beautiful, oh, the Hermes pouch is sold as well. Congratulations. Um, they've got this really beautiful silver lining, which just glows and glistens in the light. They're absolutely stunning. And then they have this beautiful design here. Um, Honestly, I think these are so stunning. And that how fun is it on you know a Friday night or a Saturday night in your house? You can play with these, um, and they also look great on the table as well. Now I'm not going to unwrap them because they are unworn. They've never been touched. They will come with their box and their ribbon as well. So we'll do do it up really nicely if you are looking to gift somebody. But they are just fabulous. Let's see if I can maybe pull one out. They are so gorgeous. How nice are these? So this is the size of them. Um, they are definitely bigger than the standard, but I think that's really fun. They're still obviously lightweight and easy to use, um, but they all have different designs. I think it's kind of like an animal theme. They're beautiful. Hey, Kimberly, um, with two items purchased from the show, can you please ship together? Yes, of course we can. And we will refund one of your shipping costs. That's absolutely fine. Um, I'm just gonna show you guys one of these and then I won't undo them again so that they're nice and fresh for whoever takes these. Um, but as mentioned, they do come with a box. And they're gonna look gorgeous, even as just a nice home display on your table. Um, really fun, really unique, and something, again, that you can keep forever for those special moments at home with your friends and family, which I love. I love pieces like this that, you know, you can enjoy as a family or with friends um, for some nice times at home. So let's get the price up of these. They are Hermes Extra Large Playing Cards. 
in an unwarned condition. They are £215, which is 237 US dollars. We cover your customs, we cover your duties, and we ship worldwide. They are pinned up there. Click on that icon. Um, I mean, a great gift for a man. Maybe if, if your family play or friends play, you know, poker. Um, I'd be really happy with this as well. Even, um, even though I don't play card games, I'd learn them just to use these. Um, and they're pinned, guys. Really good piece. Okay. Oh, this is a great one. So... I'm gonna move on to a lovely, lovely bag now. This is from Fendi. As you can see, this is um, a very iconic style for the house of Fendi. Um, they use this really beautiful, semi-sheer, lightweight mesh um, to create some of their bags. And as you can see, this is crafted from it. I love this material because it's lightweight. It's a big bag, but you can carry lots inside. The bag itself is really lightweight and easy to carry. You can see it's completely um, covered in the uh, Fendi Zuka logo. Um, and then the handles are in fact dark chocolate brown leather. You've got the Fendi logo at the top here. This really beautiful, unique style of... It's okay. <laughs> unique style of handle, this rounded shape, and we've got silver hardware um, front pocket with a zipper lock. This opens up into a really spacious compartment. Inside, we've got um, a leather base and no signs of wear to the corners. The base is nice and clean. I see some light, light marks, but no significant signs of wear on this. This is an excellent condition piece. It's lightweight. It can be carried over the arm like this. And you could even add a strap on here if you wanted to. For a shoulder piece, you do have um, silver hooks on each side that you can attach a strap to and wear it also over the shoulder as well. This for me is a great all year round bag. I would use this in the summer if I was going to a beach club. Very Dubai for me, a very Dubai bag. Or I'd use it in the winter with exactly what I'm wearing for kind of an everyday style bag. It's gonna fit a laptop in, it's gonna fit towels in, it'll fit magazines in. It's a great universal piece for all occasions. Excellent condition piece, light signs of wear, and a classic from the House of Fendi. So a really, really fun bag, easy to carry, um, and let's get the price up of this next item. Show you another close up. Actually, Kel, that's a great idea. What I will do is, if somebody buys this, I will include a free crossbody strap. I'll find a nice color to match, or we can just do a black classic plain canvas. If somebody does want to buy this, um, then go for it, and then I will include a free strap for you guys. I think that's a, that will look really nice with this. And Kel, did you get your bag yet with the strap? Um, I know we went for a classic black, so I hope you love it. In the meantime, guys, this is the X tote bag from Fendi. It's available for £890, which is US dollars Way under retail. These bags, I know, go for at least double in store. Um, even the small bucket bags in mesh um, go for around £1,700. This is a lot of bags, so I can imagine the retail is around the £2,000 mark. And it's in excellent condition as well. Um, once it's pinned, you guys will be able to shop the product. There'll be more images and details. And obviously, I'm here to answer any of your questions. Um, whoever gets this will receive a free canvas strap. So you can style it as a crossbody and you can also style it as a shoulder bag as well. It's pinned, guys. It's there. There's more images. There's details. And let me know if you guys have any questions about this particular piece. It's a great one, honestly. Really, really good one. And Kel, I'm so glad you love your bag. Congratulations. The size, Ash, let's do the size. Um, This to me looks like it would fit even like the 15 inch MacBook. I know some of you guys, we've got some like tech people on here and graphics creators and you know, the people who need those bigger laptops. Ash, the size, I've got it here, don't worry. It is actually 16 and a half inches wide. And then the height of the bag is, <laughs> size please. <laughs> uh, it's 14, so it's 16 and a half by 14 inches. 
big size. It's gonna fit the biggest MacBook. It's gonna fit that Apple Mac Pro. Um, it's gonna fit everything in. So it's a great, great size and it's so light. It literally feels like I'm carrying nothing. Honestly, it's such a great bag. And it's so classic. The Fendi Zucker is just, you know, a real classic for Fendi. It's iconic. We all love it. Monogram goes with everything. Um, and the black and brown combination is a great neutral that you can style, even with linens in the summer will look amazing. Um, Sarah. Hey, Sarah. It's tempting compared to a Chloe Woody Tote or one of those Marc Jacob ones. Yeah, it's true. This is... Um, this is a really nice style bag. I like how it's got the kind of rounded, unique handles. It gives it a, you know, a really nice look, something a bit different. And the fact that they've included a front pocket strap as well is easy to use and keeps your things organized. Linda, I will definitely have a look for some more Balenciaga clutch bags if you guys are looking for those. We always get requests for Balenciaga. Um, so we are looking for some more. So definitely stay tuned. I don't have any more in today's show. Um, today I've got coming up some more, um, I've got some Dior pieces, I've got some more um, Chanel pieces and some accessories as well. Let me show you the bottom. Bottom is nice and clean. There's just this bit here. But apart from that, it's literally excellent condition. Just some very, very light markings to the base. But overall, really good condition. And the bottom is leather. So we've got a leather base and then we've got leather interior as well. So we've got leather at the base inside and leather at the base on the exterior. So we've got leather and um, leather lay layers at the base and inside. Um, so it's, it's not the mesh at the bottom. Everything looks nice and secure at the base. Okay, okay I'm gonna move on to a very classic and iconic bag from the house of Chanel. Um, this is again kind of a really nice lighter tone to wear in the winter and the reason why I think this is a great winter white is actually it's a really durable leather as well. It has a naturally distressed look. So this is actually the Chanel 2.55 reissue classic flap. Um, the 2.55 gets its name, which is the lock here, um, from February 1955, when the first, uh, the first 2.55 bag was actually seen, no worries, that was actually seen from Chanel. So when it comes to collectible pieces, if you're looking to build out a collection of iconic and classics, you need the 2.55. This was actually the classic flap before Karl Lagerfeld came in and created that turn lock opening. So this is kind of the original classic flap. Um, they are designed to actually flat pack. So you'll see at the base of all the reissues, they have kind of a slight curve and sometimes a crease. Um, oh, thank you, Hannah. I know I've actually, I actually picked 20 pieces today, uh, but maybe I'll keep it to 15 on my, on my um, power hours. I'm glad you're lo loving the pace. Thank you, Hannah. Um, so they're actually designed to flat pack. So we've got this rounded base, a slight crease here. So when you're traveling, you can actually just flat pack these into your suitcase and they make it really easy for you to, you know, travel um, with them so they're not too bulky, you know. I, I always struggle with like my Lady Dior's um, and like the Birkins and the Kelly's when you're traveling. You can't put them in like your suitcase, whereas with this you can and you don't have to worry. So it's really, really practical and functional as well, which I love. Um, it does have a back pocket, great for a mobile phone or a small card holder. And then we've got this beautiful, beautiful reissue chain. This is one of my favorite chains from Chanel. It's like basically wet, like um, functional jewelry, as I call it. It's kind of an intricate woven design of different links, which have quilted details down the center. Um, and they're kind of like woven together. It's really, really beautiful. The metal is brushed, uh, is distressed ruthenium. So ruthenium is like a gunmetal gray. Um, and it has this naturally distressed look, which gives the bag quite a trendy and fun look as well. And I would say the color is a really light gray. Really light gray. And then you can see slight wrinkling through the leather, which you'll see in a lot of the reissue bags because they use this particularly, particular leather that is kind of like a um, naturally distressed and it's really durable actually. Um, the corner wear on this is great. There's actually barely any corner wear. There's no discoloration. There's no color transfer at the back. The bag opens up into a double flap. It has that beautiful secret compartment underneath. Hey Ash, your bag will be shipped out on uh, today if you purchase it friday it will be on its way to you today um 
Yeah, Hannah, there's no shows yet. I have another show at four o'clock, 4 p.m. BST on Instagram. And then we do actually have a show happening at two o'clock, a surprise show happening at two o'clock in an hour, just over an hour. This actually comes with a dust bag. The series on this is a 14 series. Um, it doesn't come with a card, but that's okay. It comes with its serial code, which is the most important thing. Um, we'll get the price up and I'll show you guys what this looks like on. It's a perfect over the shoulder bag. This is the jumbo size. Surprise show, Danica. Yeah. Uh, it sits nicely over the shoulder. It's a perfect cross. It kind of sits um, around the top part of the um, hip. Um, Alison, I'm so sorry. I know you were asking about this, the bag. It has actually sold. Um, it sold about 10 minutes ago. I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, I'm sorry, Alison. I know you logged on just for that bag. Um, this is available for £3,800, which is 4200 This is around £7,500 in store, honestly. It's a really, really well-priced bag with us today. Um, it's excellent condition. It's a perfect kind of light grey cream colour with that ruthenium hardware, a classic and timeless piece, and a great investment piece as well, guys. You could definitely make money off this, even this time next year you'll probably have made, you know, 1,500 pounds. So it's a great investment piece and a nice classic bag to have in your collection as well. Let's do some Dior now. Um, this Dior bag is very 2000s for me. It's really on trend right now. We're really seeing the 2000s pieces uh, being revived, coming back round, and I think it's great. I love it. It's a really fun, playful style. Um, so this is, I think, I believe this is kind of the end of the John Galliano era. Um, this is actually crafted from Dior's Oblique canvas in black. We've got that Dior Oblique, or it's known as the um, Trotter logo, all the way through the canvas. And then we've got silver hardware finish. We've got the Dior plaque to the front. We've got adjustable straps. And it's in excellent condition. This also has a small back pocket. Um, leather lined lining to, around the outside of the bag and then inside is nylon. This bag is one of, again, one of those bags that folds into such a small compact bag but actually when you fill the bag up with all of your things, the base opens up really wide. So you can see here, this is going to fit so much inside. It's going to fit an iPad, it's going to fit a diary, um, a wallet, maybe a small makeup pouch with um, some lipsticks and small compartments. It's a really, really good size piece. It also sits so seamlessly over the arm. Because it's canvas, it's super lightweight, it's a really light bag, um, silver and black, I'm an absolute sucker for at the moment, it's a really, really classic look. Um, I'm so sorry, Alison, I will try and find another one of those bags. I've never seen it, but I will try my best, I promise. And you can see we've got leather details, beautiful silver plaque to the front with the Dior logo, um, and it's in excellent condition. This is a great bag. It's also really nicely styled, just classically over the arm. It goes nicely over the shoulder, and you've also got those adjustable straps as well. So we'll get the price up of this one. Very on trend, excellent condition, a kind of, a, a, almost like a small size tote bag. Um, it's £585, which is 646 US dollars. Customs and duties are covered and we ship worldwide. Just remember guys, we only cover customs and duties for the duration of the show. So you do have to check out within the next kind of seven or eight minutes. Um, all items will be shipped out tomorrow. The Dior bag is pinned. This is a very me bag, if I'm honest. I really like this style. Um, it's a great kind of everyday bag. I'd also wear this in the evening as well. I think it's gorgeous. Um, it's pinned there. Let me know if you have any questions. It's a gorgeous, classic, and very collectible early 2000s Dior bag. So she's a good one. Okay, so I have some jewellery left. I also have a couple of Chanel bags and a Gucci bag. So you guys let me know what you want to see. I'm not going to have time to show everything. Um, if you want to see Chanel, Gucci or jewellery, let me know in the comments um, and I can show you guys what you want to see. I've got, um, I'm going to do another pair of earrings and then you guys let me know what you want the last item to be. So these are um, Chanel vintage earrings. They come with a box, so make a great gift. And these are, again, just like the turn locks that I mentioned. Z wants to see jewellery. Good. I've picked some um, Chanel earrings. Um, 
These are a very, very collectible pair of earrings. Um, just like the turn locks, these are known as the door knockers. And the door knockers are a, you can actually wear these in several ways. So I'll talk you guys through how you can wear these. But they're kind of a two-in-one earring and they were designed in the 80s and they are so, so collectible. Um, they come in several different styles. These particular ones here are just the classic gold quilting. So again, an if you know, you know pair of earrings. Um, Penny, I need to double check that. Um, I might be able to do that in a second. Give me a second and I'll be able to do that. So these are the door knockers. They are quilted and they are what looks like a really amazing pair of hoops. But actually the door knocker gets its name from the fact that you can actually remove the hoop and you can wear these as a smaller style kind of um, clip, clipped on hoop as well. These are like a day to night earring like you can go out you can wear the kind of classic hoop and then you can actually if you end up going out in the evening you can actually pop the hoop on and you've got two in one which i absolutely love i think this is such a fun clever piece of jewelry these are from the 80s these are 80s they are iconic um and as well what you can do is you can actually add no worries. You can actually add the hoop onto a gold chain or a necklace, and you can actually wear this as a Chanel pendant as well. So there's three ways you can wear them. You've got the nice daytime, you've got that evening, and then you've got daytime with a necklace. <laughs> I love them. I think they're so fun. Um, there's no tarnish, Lisa. Honestly, these are really, really beautiful. Let me show you the back. No tarnish, bright, shiny gold. Maybe tiny, tiny bit of tarnish just here. But I'd still rate these, you know, a good eight out of 10 considering that they are 80s vintage, 24 karat gold. They come with a box. They are absolutely fabulous. They are one of my favorite pairs of earrings. It's like a two in one situation with a necklace um, and they look amazing. So let's get the price of these. They're gonna come with a box. They are in excellent condition. They are quilted, quilted gold. They are, that price is insane, insane, insane. I always see these 1,200 pound plus. I don't know what's going on today, guys, but that price is insane. They are 975 pounds, which is 1,077 US dollars covered customs and duties we are shipping worldwide guys and you can find these through the icon to that top left hand corner honestly i want you all right now to go to google and type in chanel door knockers and see for yourself how much these go for honestly that price is amazing this is like several hundred pounds under what we should be selling them at um so have a look let me know if i can help you with anything let's see if we can do a price drop on the um let me have a look Let's see if we can do a price drop on the turn lock earrings for, who is this for? My lovely Penny. Penny, let's see what we can do for you on these earrings. ASL 4126. Okay. Uh, okay, right. The best, best, best price I can do is I can give you... Okay, I can do them at £995. Penny, they have been changed. I've given you £150 off these earrings. They are now 995 The price has changed. Refresh the page. They are also going to be pinned in that top left-hand corner in a second. I hope you're happy with that price. That's the best, best, best price I can do. They're 1996, in excellent condition. They're the size large for 995 pounds, guys. I've changed that price. Click on that icon. Um, and I hope one of you gets them because they are fabulous. And at that price, way under market. I can try them on. I love them, honestly. I actually have a pair myself. This is what they look like on. So I'm like covered in earrings, by the way. So they, they're like overlapping my other piercings slightly. But honestly, they are so, they feel like you're wearing nothing. Honestly, they're absolutely gorgeous. They are a comfortable clip. They're lightweight. They are stunning, especially with like a nice kind of hair up classic look. Um, 
they are just, you know, they're the statement. They're the, that's all you need. They really, really are beautiful. Um, I've also seen some people wearing them as a necklace as well. Clipped on a chain, which is a, another great look. Um, 995, guys. Check them out. So I did see a request. Somebody does want to see Gucci. So I'm going to show a Gucci bag. Um, but now would be a great time for you guys to let me know if um, you want me to recap anything I've shown so far. I'm going to show one more bag. And then that's my power hour over. So the final bag I've got is a Gucci. I've gone for lots of satchel styles today, actually. I was, maybe I was feeling nice daytime looks. This is actually a coated canvas GG Gucci satchel bag with silver hardware. Now this has um, clips to each side, buckles, which open up the bag. And then inside is a cotton lining interior with an additional compartment here, plus its original, um, original Gucci bag. Um, this has a canvas, earrings have sold. Congratulations to whoever got those. Great choice. Honestly, they are so good. Um, they should be literally part of the Luxury Promise uniform. We all have a pair of turn locks. This has a canvas strap. It's super lightweight and easy to wear. Um, this is great as well because you can adjust the length of the canvas to really, really short or really, really long, depending on how you like your fit. It's in excellent condition. And that's the beauty of coated canvas. This is a great bag for um, those horrible cold winter months. Um, the coated canvas just adds that extra layer of protection and durability and there's actually no corner wear on this or signs of wear. So it's a really excellent condition piece. Definitely a unisex piece. It's a nice, comfortable, practical bag, but also really stylish and classic as well. It's classic silver and black um, in an excellent condition with its original dust bag. So this will be the last item, guys. I don't have any more time to show any bags, but I'm back on Instagram. Um at 4 p.m. BST. So literally in three hours, I'm back on Instagram and I hope to see you guys there. This is this price, 280 pounds for a whole Gucci bag, right? This is insane. Um, 280 pounds, again, think, think ahead, Christmas. Anybody would love this for Christmas. Anybody that would love this for their birthday, 280 pounds, that's three, just over 300 US dollars. And we cover customs and duties. We ship worldwide. Um, it's a classic satchel crossbody. It's um, beautiful and shiny, as you can see, and it is pinned in that top left-hand corner. Okay. So that's it, guys, for the quick power hour. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope to see you guys um, at 4 p.m. on my show on Instagram, but stay tuned. In just under an hour, Elena is going live for a surprise live show from the London Boutique. Um, congratulations to those of you who, got, uh, who made some purchases today. All items will be shipped out tomorrow. Um, enjoy the rest of your day. I hope to see you guys soon and see you later. Bye.